Hi everyone, I'm Mike, and this is the Luxury Home Channel on YouTube. So we are in South Tampa today, and we're looking at this beautiful home behind me built by Arjun Builders. So this home is four bedrooms, three full baths, one half bath, with 3,200 square feet of living, and the asking price for this home is $1.39 five million dollars so what we're going to do is we're going to take a look on the outside of this home and then take you on the inside the inside of this home is absolutely beautiful with quartz countertops uh the half bath is actually one of my favorite half baths i think i've ever seen and this builder is uh building a lot of the area here in the tampa st petersburg area and you can have homes all the way up to seven thousand plus square feet with a whole bunch of different designs as you see here so let's go ahead uh, and look at the outside of this home and describe the outside of this home so as we come up the first thing that we notice is this driveway and the driveway is really neat because we have this concrete driveway it's a single slab but we have these inserts in the driveway with the astroturf going in that actually really gives it a pretty cool feel to the home and actually matches the modern style that we see this has got a three-car garage with these really cool garage doors and then on the right side of the home what we see is a wood panel going all the way up and of course this is a very tall home we have 12 foot ceilings on the first floor 10 foot ceilings on the second floor so it's a very tall home now on the other side of the home uh, the actual side of the home comes out a little bit further than the garage and they colored it a uh, gray color which is a nice texture with the whites and the blacks as well definitely a very modern touch so let's go ahead and go to the right and come over here and we see this landscaping area we do have a raised garden over here with the plants coming out and this is right in front of the dining room as you can see with these windows and then we do have some nice landscaping over here also and then we step up and as soon as we step up we go onto the ceramic tile now the ceramic tile are huge tiles you'll see it as we go in and see how big these are so let's go ahead and go inside and show you the rest of the home all right welcome to this beautiful and modern home so let me go ahead and close this door and as i close the door let's talk about the door obviously the door is very modern with metal frame and also glass you have glass all the way around so you get plenty of light coming into this beautiful home and then i'm here into the grand entryway and below me is are some tiles and the tiles are actually tiles i've never seen tiles this size they're about four and a half feet by two and a half feet measured by my shoes um, so they're extremely large much much larger than anything i've seen before and then when i look up i look up over 22 feet high to this absolutely amazing modern chandelier with all these lights fixtures that come down to give you some really nice light on the uh, entryway now to my right is a stairway and of course we keep with that modern theme with these metal rails that are bolted in underneath the stairway and actually the stairs actually uh, protrude a little bit over the actual framing of the actual home so that's neat and then over to your right to my left is going to be your dining room now the dining room is currently set up for a table of six. And the one thing that I notice about this dining room are the windows looking out. You have these beautiful windows looking out into your front yard. And then of course, what everyone probably will notice is this light fixture above me. We get that same modern feel, these little squares and rectangles with LED lights in between. Absolutely awesome light fixture. I really, really do like that. So what I talked to you about outside was a half bath, was my favorite half bath. Let's go check that out. That's over in this direction. So follow me here as we go down this hallway. We're in the under the stairs room or the what I like to call the Harry Potter room, but this one's actually a half bath. And as you can see, we have this vanity here, also very modern with quartz countertops. And we have this faucet that actually protrudes out of the actual uh, ceramic uh, backsplash here. And then of course this backsplash, this tile work is absolutely beautiful. It grays, there's bronzes and browns in here, and it really stands out. And we, we have the toilet right behind me. Another cool little feature is this little shelving area here where you can put some of your favorite little knickknacks that you may like. So, hey, if you're watching this so far, do me a huge favor, hit the like button on YouTube and subscribe to our channel. We do a whole bunch of homes or we're planning to do a bunch of homes within the state of Florida. And we're currently in Tampa. We're gonna be doing Miami and everything else. So definitely subscribe to our channel. But as we come back this direction, we go into the family room. So the family room is a very modern family room as well. A couple of features that I wanna point out here is first of all, the the tile work that we have that leads up to this fireplace is actually inserted into the wall. And then we have this huge feature here that is 
uh, protruding tile work that has uh, space for your TV. So you can be sitting down and enjoying the TV. We also have the surround sound speakers so that if you wanna watch your movies and surround sound, it's all set up for that. Also, of course, we can't forget how tall these ceilings are as well. So let's go and go to the kitchen, which has a ton of modern features. So we're here and we see we have a whole row of cabinets here. So let me go ahead and show you what we have. We, this one here, we open it up and it actually has a quartz countertop vanity with a little sink here. So this is a great area to put, whether you want coffee or wine or anything like that, you can have that here. And then when you're done with it, you just close it back up and it has a soft close. The next cabinet I pull out, you can see has all the space so you can actually put all your items and easily get into the items as you can see. And then we have this. So what is this? Well, it's the refrigerator freezer, at least I think it is. Yep, so you have your fridge freezer right here. This is all stocked up with all your Cokes and waters and Perrier water. Let's go ahead and close that. And then this is the exact same that was on the other side of the fridge, just more storage space for all your dry goods. Right next to that is gonna be your pantry. Just open this up. It doesn't have any shelving in there right now, but you have plenty of space to store more items there. So let's go ahead and come this direction and talk about the actual kitchen. The kitchen has got the quartz countertops. It's also got quartz backsplash. Uh, we do have uh, a darker brown color on the left, your right, and then on the other side, a little bit lighter. That's very common with some of these high-end homes. Uh, we do have a electric stove top, and then we have the air vent that vents all your stuff out. And then this cabinet here, let's see if I can remember how to open this up. Yeah, you just do that and that opens up for all your storage needs there. And then on the other side, we do have our microwave and this one does have the push button where you open it up. And then you can also close it with that same button. Right next to this is, looks like part of the storage area, but this is actually gonna be your dishwasher. And then we have the sink with this faucet, highly upgraded faucet, all chromed out. And then plenty of drawers and storage. And then we have this high tech double oven, all touch, touch display on here to do all your cooking that you may need in the oven for Thanksgiving. So come around here, another neat feature is this countertop actually drops down a little level. Um, and then you can have a sitting area. In the sitting area, you do have a couple little charge points for your cell phones. And then of course we see these modern pendant lights. We also have speakers in the kitchen. And another thing that I do want to mention while we're here, right above the kitchen cabinets, you see this little vent there. That's actually your AC vent, a little bit different than you see in many of the other homes. So follow me this direction. We're going to go over to this part of the home. We have a door here. This door goes out to the three car garage. So the three car garage has got a really nice epoxy floor. And then we also have a door that goes outside over on the uh, end of the home there. So we're gonna go right across from the garage to this. This will be the second bedroom. It's currently set up as an office, but this is actually your second bedroom. We do have a closet. We have a couple windows for some natural light and we have a propeller style fan above us with recessed lights. And then we have a full bathroom here. And this bathroom is beautiful. Like nearly everything in this house, very modern, very beautiful. We have the vanity here. We have the faucet and this modern light fixture and then the shower, which is a frameless shower, beautiful flooring. And of course the tile work goes all the way up to the ceiling. We do have a toilet behind me. And then over here, we do have a door that goes outside. So if you did want to add a pool, there's an out outdoor kitchen. We'll show you that later outside there, but let's go ahead. I'll meet you back over by the front door and then we'll take a tour of the second floor of the home. All right, so here we are back by the front entrance. Let's go ahead and go upstairs. I'll meet you up there. All right, so as I come up here, I do want you to notice these beautiful windows that you saw on the outside of the home and how it looks here on the inside, giving a lot of natural light when we come up to the second floor of the home. Now we're in the hallway. We're gonna go straight down. And then the first room on the right is gonna be the primary bedroom. However, before we go there, if I look left, we see some more windows that give you that natural light and of course the beautiful chandelier that we saw when we first walked in. So let's go ahead and go right to your left or to my right and come into the primary bedroom suite. This is a very large room. 
plenty of space here. You can probably fit a couple king size beds in here very easily. We do have windows above the actual bed for that natural light and of course windows pointing out to the backyard. Above me we have speakers so you can have whatever music you want playing in here and of course that modern style propeller looking fan. To my right is going to be a very spacious closet. Currently doesn't have any shelves in it so as you can see this is big enough to put an office in but obviously you can put some customized shelving in here for all your clothes and then the best part is the actual bathroom. The tile work in the bathroom is absolutely amazing. So come and follow me and we go into the bathroom. So let's talk about this bathroom. The first thing that stands out obviously are the tiles on the wall and on the floor. The grain work in these tiles just really stick out with the grays and the golden browns. And then of course we have the double vanity uh, with the sink here and of course the faucet that actually protrudes from the actual backsplash. This mirror, it has LED light around it. So as we turn it on and off, it really gives some really nice ambience. We have a window in between the two sinks, giving you plenty of natural light, a little makeup area. And of course we have another sink behind me. Also the window looking out for more light that way. And then to the other direction is gonna be your shower area. So as I step into the shower, you can see we have plenty of space here. We have two faucets, one regular shower head, and of course a rain shower head above me. And then to my left or to your right would be the actual tub. And it has the actual faucets coming out of the tile work. So um, the water closet is just behind the camera or to your left, to my right, right here. And of course, if you're in here, sort of like you're in a Taj Mahal of water closets. So. Let's go ahead, I'll show you the other bedrooms really quickly, mainly go show you the, the bathrooms and the tile work, because a lot of the bedrooms are actually not staged with furniture, so we'll go through those pretty quickly. But first of all, we'll come this direction, and you can see the actual hallway going down the whole second floor. So really quick, this will be bedroom number three. Good size bedroom here. We have a closet to my right, and let's go ahead and go right into the bathroom to show you the more interesting stuff. And of course we have the tub here to my right. To my left is gonna be another vanity. We're gonna have a dual sink. And then look at these beautiful hexagon shaped uh, tile backsplash that the faucets actually come out. We do have frame mirrors here. They're not as fancy as the ones in the primary bedroom that have the light around it, but we do have a nice modern light fixture above the frame mirrors. So we keep on coming this direction. We do have a water closet here with a privacy door. And then we go into bedroom four. Bedroom four, obviously like all the others, we have the recessed lights and the modern uh, fan fixture. We do have a closet right here. And then we have our laundry room where you can do all your laundry in this wing of the house. Nice countertops, all the modern features go throughout with the cabinets and everything. So we've seen everything except for the actual summer kitchen outside. So I'll meet you outside right now. <laughs> all right. So I see our camera person made it downstairs a little bit faster than I did as I come through the sliding glass door that left, uh, leads off the kitchen. And we are outside. We have these same uh, ceramic tile floors underneath me. And of course we have our summer kitchen. But before we talk about the summer kitchen, this door right here is the door that goes out from the bathroom that we saw uh, downstairs, the second bathroom. Um, here is the uh, outdoor kitchen. Uh, as you can see, we have the sink, we have plenty of storage, and then we have the barbecue here. And of course, all this beautiful tile work, the stone work, uh, great countertops, and we also have the vent going out. And then we have our backyard behind me. Another feature about this specific space is when I look up, when I look up, I see these beautiful wood ceilings with speakers and recessed lights, and of course, a nice fan. Now, if you watch this, if you have a home for sale in the Florida area, whether you're a realtor, a listing realtor with a million dollar home or an actual uh, person that owns a home and you'd like us to come and actually film your home, make sure you contact us. All our contact information is below. Or if you're thinking about pur purchasing a home in Florida, make sure you contact us as well. I'll make sure you get in touch with the right realtor, whether it's myself or one of my realtor partners throughout Florida. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Take care. Bye-bye.